What's up guys, my name is Will Palmer from Stingray Customs. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to turn a beat pair of slides like this into a masterpiece. Make sure you stick around to the end of the video to see the final product. I started the shoe off by prepping the shoe with sandpaper. Then I used acetone with a scotch red pad and cotton balls to get off that factory finish. Next, I laid my base coat down, which is going to be the color that the stencil showed. Then I laid down the stencil. I also used a heat gun to heat set the vinyl stencil to make it stick better. Next, I laid down my top coat, which was a dark brown. A little bit later on, after I heat set, my paint, I went in with an X-Acto knife and took off all the stencils. As you can see, the stencil is not perfect, there's a little bit of paint leaking, so later on I went in with the micro detail brush and touched those stencils up. This was the part where I touched the shoe up with the micro detail brush. Attention to detail here is key. Okay, so now that we are finished with that, I know I didn't get to show all the touching up process, but that my camera died, so that was a little off camera stuff. But all I did was just on this Louis Vuitton print, I did a touch up on this and I touched up all the like paint leaks and stuff like that. So here is the final product, the slides. Um, 
these only took about eight hours. Also, I took the rose gold and mixed it with some too soft for that fabric material right here. Um, for that rose goldish brown Nike swoosh to match with the Louis Vuitton print. And then I finished it off with a uh, number 600 acrylic finisher because I kind of wanted a gloss finish like the bags. Uh, my goal here was to imitate the iconic Louis Vuitton purses. And I did use Angelus Brown paint, but I made my, I took an old Angelus bottle, made my own kind of rose gold to, because I did not have a, a good color that would match this stuff, so I made my own. And then I finished it off with some too thin, I mean not too thin, sorry, too soft to uh, mix it. And then, like I said, I put on the acrylic finisher. So that'll wrap us up for today's video. Um... I will be doing an Angelus Direct product giveaway at 500 subscribers, so make sure you subscribe so you have a chance at winning that. Um, and thanks for watching. I guess that's the end of the video, and I'll show you guys a few pics of me wearing these on feet.